Alrighty, welcome back to the to my channel. Um, I'm the Modern Josephus, and last time we were here yesterday, I had taken over Louisburg. Now, it is true that in this battle, most of the troops were colonial troops, colonial troops. And they were able to take over Louisburg, and it was the first major colonial victory where, you know, the force was made up of a lot of Massachusetts, men from Massachusetts. Um, so that was quite impressive for the time. Um, and they were able to show up the British and re show them that they could actually handle a war. So we're going to go ahead and uh, start recruiting, get this going. We have to take Montreal and we have to take Quebec. And that shouldn't be too hard. So we'll go ahead and play. So I have this British army. I don't know why they're not heading toward Quebec. That to me would sound like the best deal to do right now. Um, why they're coming up to that little mill, I have no idea. I'm just glad that these guys are moving away from me. Um, that makes me really happy. Unless they're going to cross through here. So that should be something I should look at. Um, I know I have this force here. There's no troops that way. I mean, I literally could come and just take Quebec. Literally. But we're not going to do that yet. I'm going to come down here, move that force there, probably. Yeah, we have to we have to get these guys back up to par. And I know I don't have a lot of troops, a lot of money to do that. Kind of, kind of running low on funds at the moment. And I also have to bring these two armies back down here. So that's what I'm going to be doing. In the meantime, we'll try to strengthen this up as best I can while they are moving across country. Doesn't really seem like I'm going to need a lot of stuff. So that's good. I think with just these two combined armies, I should be good. So let's go ahead and do this. No extra men are needed. I have all these dudes just like marching here. They have a larger army than I do and could easily take Quebec and Montreal. Instead, they're going to leave me to do that. Like, why do you need a whole army? Three-star general way up there. What, what in the world? They're going to settle here in this little log thing? Oh, my word. Okay, so this guy's going to come from Quebec. I mean, have fun, bro. Okay. So they're going to leave that there. Bring these guys here. I mean, I'm really not afraid of the French right now. Letter of the man, some Acadia. Well, while you guys are doing your letter of the man's, I'm going to bring this guy. And George Washington, why can't he move that far? What is going on? Okay, I'm going to bring my fleet up. And bring him to the tippity top here. Oh, I see. He has to come in. Oh, I see. All right, whatever. Well, we have this British guy, so he'll be able to take care of any business there. make this guy a general. We'll recruit some men 
Now we won't recruit anybody in this round. All right. This is a lot easier when you're just playing this campaign because, believe me, when you play a global campaign, it is crazy. It gets to be very crazy. You're just everywhere. Okay, you go in, in there. Take care of that business. Sometimes you just, in order to bring peace, you have to lay down the rules. What do we have here? Okay, we'll leave them there for now. Yeah, I only have 105. What did I just spend it on? Nothing. Okay. All right. Uh. Let's come into this town here, and we're ready to strike Quebec. I mean, I'm not really afraid of these guys. We can recruit some dudes. What's the army looking like? Two cannon? Okay, we'll just recruit those guys, and we'll go here. This campaign shouldn't take too long. This time I'm going to make sure I only play a half hour because, man, downloading all the, downloading everything I had to download last time was not fun. It was not fun, I'll tell you that much. Oh, wow. Okay, so we're going to do that. Right. They have 660. Okay. Let's demand their surrender. Oh, they surrendered. Nice. So I hold this fort. I can't go anywhere else, and I'm not going to try. What I'm going to do is I'm going to move here. I'm going to siege, siege it, siege this fort. Yeah, siege the fort. And let's recruit some men. All right. Okay, this guy's going to march to the relief here. What I'm going to do then is fall back because I don't think I can take care of both. This is a combination about over 1,500 men, yeah. I can't retreat. Well, that stinks. They have four cannon. I have two. <sighs> they have a lot of Native Americans. Can I win? I have... They have a lot of troops with guns. That's the thing. I have three cavalry. I'm just going to auto resolve. Oh, I won? What? I won. Dude. The odds were not in my favor, and I won. I don't know what this guy's doing, but good luck, man. Yeah, fun. So now capturing Montreal will not be a problem. It's going to be a lot easier than what happened in real life. So all I'm going to do is move my army here. I'm just going to auto resolve this. I don't really care about spending too much time anymore. No, what we'll do is we'll just do a siege. A siege. These guys are going to have to move now. And I'm going to have to do this.
reinforce my men. Okay. Looks good. Sounds good. Okay. Well, they surrendered really easily. Okay. Let's go ahead and then join over here. Leave that to burn. Yeah. So we have two armies sieging this place. All right. I mean, why waste my time? You know? Why waste my time? It's going to be an overwhelming victory. There's no need to play play around here. Okay. All right. What? What? My word, come on. Stop playing. Occupy this, please. Okay, so George Washington, he'll siege that. Be a glorious siege. Here, we'll repair this. We'll send these dudes into here. Because here with these guys, I'm just like on this recoup mission right here. Recuperating, getting our breath together. What I, and I should probably do that with the other dudes too. Now in Rome, in Total War Rome, you cannot recruit people if you don't own the territory, which makes a little bit more sense. Now what you can do is you can recruit um you can recruit um mercenaries in enemy territory, but you can't recruit any of your men in enemy territory. So that's kind of different. Probably makes, well, probably makes more sense. All right, so let's just, okay. As always, people making demands when they're in no position to make demands. The only demand that I want from you guys is to stop doing what you're doing. That's my only demand for y'all. All right, so let's go to the next. 14 to 16. Should I move these guys up? Should I fight the last big battle, George Washington versus Louis-Joseph de Montcalm? Yes, I will. Why not? If they're going to attack me, I will oblige. And we'll probably end it here with this last one. Okay. Raining. Oh, I remember this. Yeah, I remember this. Yeah. We're going to have to move up. There's no other. There's nothing else to do there. Nice ship, though. 
All those soldiers fit in this ship? Doubt it. All right. Here we go. The planes. I wonder if this is supposed to be the planes of Abraham right here. That's probably what this is, is the planes of Abraham. Let's see, are there any other planes up here? No, there's no other plane, like anything that looks like a plane. So this down here has to be the planes of Abraham. Cool. Hmm. All right, well, I, are these guys going to advance on me? Look at that. All they have is militiamen and pikemen. What's in here? Okay, they have some soldiers there. Their cannon is way over there. I mean, I don't think they're going to attack me. And if these guys are preparing to shoot, I don't even know what they're going to shoot at. Nope, they're not. Yeah, I don't... I don't think they're going to attack. Okay, we'll just see what happens when I do that. <laughs> oh, my word. These charges or whatever you want to call it, marches or whatnot, is sometimes gets kind of ridiculous. I'm going to do... Okay, are they going to come? Probably not. I mean, their best bet is just to stay up here. Well, maybe maybe they are coming. Okay. Well, let's get this prepared. Uh, you know what? What we'll do is just do this. Yeah, this is what I'm going to do. I'm just going to create a... thing here. Like, do this, cover all this here. And see what they do. That's about it right there. I'm gonna position these cannon. They're just going to have wave after wave after wave of, of soldiers attacking. And they're going to get cut to pieces. I mean, it's not even... Because a lot of them are just spear dudes, for real. 
Look at these guys with their long whatever spears or whatnot. I mean, how is that a win? And they're dropping everywhere. Okay, here they have some riflemen. These guys are in position. Okay. Yeah, they're they're already ready to run. Then we have this second line ready to fire. These guys are probably going to take a big beating. Oh well. It is what it is. Yeah, these guys will charge and then these guys eventually will fire. These guys are just getting mauled. Well, could send in a cavalry unit. Send in the cavalry. These guys, though, they have. A, they're just gonna keep pouring it in. I don't know if the Plains of Abraham was this dramatic, but definitely we've got a lot going on here. You got cannon shooting way up here. I don't know at what. Like the battle's down here, bro. You guys shoot at them. Back here. They don't dress their lines again? Like, what's going on? Oh, wow, yeah. They're just falling everywhere. Wow. All right, we got them on the run, them on the run. Wow, these guys are down to 23. <laughs> brave men, brave lads, brave lads. We still, these guys are down to 90. But well, we've inflicted our damage. I need some cannons to shoot at them, them dudes, since they're rallied. How many men do they have? 110, okay. They're starting to falter. Yeah. Okay, let's try hitting these guys now. Got 
and get the guys who are who are reformed. Man, just look at the bloodshed. <laughs> Whoa, some of these guys are like floating in the air. Look at that. They're dead floating in the air. People wish they could do that. All right, so here comes our cavalry charge, which is just stopped right in its tracks. By the time they got to my men, they're no more. <laughs> they are no more. Okay, so they're all on the run. I mean, do they even have anybody not running? Well, all their forces are just running. Running. They're not even stopping for anything. They're just running. They're saying, get me out of here. Hmm. Well, I'm going to have to move my men up. Oh, here come some lads. Here come some lads. So they just basically go around the mountain. <laughs> How many men do they have? 119. Okay. I mean, if I do go up, I'm not going to take the front units because the front units are basically decimated. These guys, I think, can reach them. Don't kill anyone, man. Just aim up that way. How are we going to do? I just hope that we don't kill anybody. I need my men. Are you guys going to fire? Is that our range? Hmm. Oh man, they are running. They're like, we leave! We leave! Get us out of here! We are gun, we are gun, we are gun. Do not do anything more to us. Do not hurt us anymore. Here we come. Dude, you guys are not going to march up that way. We all know it. Stop playing. Okay, somebody's shooting cannons up here. Okay, so this side is has lost men. Okay. I just have like this big old army marching up. I would have hated to have been living in this kind of a situation. All right, well, if they ever come back, you guys stay there. The rest. We'll come up and take whatever is left up here of these. 
these dudes. Somebody's coming charging. So all we have is some cavalry and a bunch of cannons. No one's in the fort. So So all that to say we should be okay. I'm leaving my my Oh, where are we shooting at up here, buddy? Let's bring these guys. Let's just march on them. March them up to here. There we go. I have all these forces just marching up. How cool is that? I'll leave these guys here. They took the worst of the fighting. These guys are going to annoy me if they're going to shoot like that. They're just going to annoy me. So just lumber up and come up here. Limber. Come on. What are you guys waiting for? Man, all, all their dudes are gone. They're gone. Look at that. No one is left except for these dudes. And we're pretty even. 59 to 67. I got a little bit of an edge. I'll bring these guys up here. These guys can come on up here. Charge. Imagine just being here and all of a sudden cavalry just swarms in and just destroys you. Well, that's what's going on. That's basically all I have to do is this mopping up operation. Take care of this business. Hopefully. <laughs> Who is this guy here? Wow, that's an interesting uniform. They're colonials. <laughs> Sorry, I like looking at the uniforms too because it's interesting to to see. So these guys then, well, this guy's French. This guy though is mine. Okay. General killed. Nice. Of course, I only have 10 too, so that ain't very cool. Whoa, did we kill them all? Okay, no. But. Okay. Can we take care of these dudes? Yes, we can.
Who are those British dudes? Whoa. What a drop off. Are they French? They're French. Was that cavalry? Yeah, French. I mean artillery, French artillery. Interesting. Just routed, 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 routed. That's the last of them. These guys aren't even going to rally. Man, the Native Americans still haven't left the map, but this guy is all the way over here. <laughs> oh man, come on, just a clear victory. Like, what are we waiting for? For these guys to route, and that's what we're waiting for. Seriously? There. They're routed. Alright, let's kind of just speed this up. Dun, 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 dun. There we go. The end of the battle. Heroic victory. And we have taken all of Canada. So we won. We always have been, we are, and I hope that we always shall be detested in France. Arthur Wellesley, Duke of Wellington, British General and Prime Minister. Don't tell me you're going to, well. All right. Uh, that's probably the end. I'm just going to end the video here because I don't know how long this is going to take. Um, but we'll see you guys later. Have a good evening. See you tomorrow. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Adios.